Start it up. Hey, what's going on, everybody? Welcome back once again to Remote Troops. Excited to be here with you guys today, playing some more Rush Royale, guys. If y'all are loving this game, show it some love down below. Okay, leave a like on it, share it with your friends, all of the above. We are trying to grow this game, we are trying to make it popular. I love playing it, I know that you guys love playing it as well. Um, it's super, super fun. Look at this, I haven't even gone into my store yet. <clears throat> oh, let's go. Do I want to buy any of these? No, not really. So, this is my deck that I've been playing right now and working on learning and having a lot of fun with. Um, it's based around the Demonologist. So if you don't have him, this deck doesn't really apply, but this is still going to be super fun for you guys to watch because you can make some crazy moves with the Demonologist. It's a lot of fun. If you do have the Demonologist, but you don't have any of some of these other ones, you can replace the Vampire with um, the Priest or the Priestess right here, um, and it'll still work just fine. You can replace Harlequin uh, with the Mime if you have that. You can replace Engineer with... Uh, any sort of good DPS, whether that's the Archer or the Wind Archer or whatever. Obviously, it won't work as effectively, but um, it'll still be good. So, we're going to go ahead and just jump into this. We're at 6116, um, messing around with Demonologists. So, um, what I really want and what I'm looking forward to is getting the Shaman um, to throw in this deck as well. And then I think it's going to be really freaking annoying that's the goal with it i feel like i'm a little bit bright right now let's do ooh, ooh, oh oh uh, oh okay so that's kind of what we're working with absolutely loving this deck absolutely loving this game play it way more than any other game right now um and it's just fun 99 year life i feel like i've gone up against this person before they uh do not have they do have shaman i was just about to say they do not have shaman but they do i thought that what I saw up there was the vampire, but they do not have vampire. That's what it is. <clears throat> so, he actually got a pretty... So okay, so he's going to go after me on this one, which is fine. Um, because he's he's spinning a lot right now. What I really need is a vampire, and I'm not... Oh, got it. <clears throat> and I'm not getting one. There we go. So, got a vampire now. And uh, we're going to go ahead and put one into that. Nice. He's going to throw that over. So his deck is actually super fun. Um, I would love to be able to play that style of deck, but obviously without the vampire, it is not really possible. Um, I'm going to level this up one more time, and I'm about to be in trouble from him. Actually, no, I, I should be totally fine because the vampire is going to start doing some work for us, um, and he's slowly running out of mana. That's the thing about the priestess is that she falls off late game. Um, the vampire does not because the vampire makes his move, and he gets you, he gets you everything that you need. Um... And he, and he really, really helps you out. So, right here, we're kind of just hanging out. Um, Bedlam's going to be coming up shortly. I would love to be... You know, I'm going to start putting a little bit of pressure on him just by sending that one. So, sending that one uh, costs... Or it has 2,000 health over there. So, hopefully, his... Wow, his Boreas was... Um, his Boreas was procced right there. So, he melted it in two seconds. Generally, with the Demonologist, you don't want to use them. Um, in the first like three rounds unless you absolutely have to now this guy's just starting to put really annoying pressure on me um, So we got to try and get these guys up. You can see that one right there has 3k health um, It's three times the current level of the mini boss or of the mini things so you can see that has one 1,000 health um, That is what it ends up doing right there. Okay, so we should be good here I'm gonna go ahead and actually probably put a little bit into um, our engineers because now he's starting to get a little bit overrun I'm gonna go ahead and do this too just to get that up and rolling for us now with bedlam I don't want to merge my demons or my demonologist, but I do want to merge my summoners if I get any So we'll merge these I'll do this because that just keeps things that just keeps things uh, leveling up for you, which is great um, So we already melted ours a little bit too soon actually I'm, I'm gonna do this real quick Nah, that wasn't the, that wasn't a good move. Uh, if I had done it earlier, then we would have been in a good spot. So he's gonna take a shot right there, um, and then obviously this is no, this might not. It'll go down. It'll go down, right? It's gonna go down. There's yeah, I was about to say there's no way that it doesn't go down. Um, but now you guys can see how freaking strong all of this can be for us. Um, so I'm actually gonna do all this just to kind of uh, get us going with. Some good defense, especially since he doesn't have a Boreas anymore. So he messed up. He merged too much. He was trying to take us out. Um, and by doing so, he got rid of his Boreas, which was his really his only his only source of DPS. So there was nothing that he could do there. 
Um, we can do this, and uh, now I can just merge these, and he's gonna die in just a couple seconds. I wish we could have killed him with. Um, I wish we could have killed him with Demonologist, but I don't think we're gonna be able to. Yep, so he's at 6178, a little bit higher than us, 61% win rate. We are at a 56% win rate. Um, a lot of that is due to us just trying um, new stuff and losing a lot. I tried to do a video the other day. It didn't work without uh, using any legendaries and using as many commons as I could. Uh, and somebody posted about it on Reddit. They were like, dude, what the freak are you playing with right now? Um, and so I've tried out a lot of things just like I do in Clash Royale where I'll try things that hopefully you guys can play because a lot of you guys won't have these legendaries. You will have legendaries, but you might not have these legendaries. There's something to do. Comment down below the legendaries that you do have and then also which one you want. For me, gosh, I want Shaman and Inquisitor um, because I think Inquisitor is stupid strong, man. Inquisitor, like, it does struggle a little bit against Shaman if you're facing Shaman, but only if the Shaman hits your Inquisitor. If you have other things down, that's just RNG, and that's just the way that it goes, you know what I mean? Um, Inquisitor, I think you need one, four, one, four, nine. One of them down, four of them down, and nine of them down. Um, oh man, dude, dang it, I should have freaking mirrored, there we go. I was about to say, I should have mirrored my vampire. This is a solid start for us right now. Um, so this guy is going to have a pretty good deck because he's got a lot of control in it. Uh, in the fact that he has Bombardier, um, and then also the Sharpshooter does great damage against bosses. Uh, that's what it's designed to do, and so that's something that we just have to keep in mind. Now, thankfully, he isn't running Vampire. I think his deck would be a lot stronger with Vampire. He has Priestess in it, which isn't as good, in my opinion, with just Harlequin, because you want to be able to merge it pretty much at all times, and if you're not able to, then you're, you're just going to end up running into some problems. So I'm going to go ahead and I need to I need to mirror some of these things. Uh, I did send over a couple of, um, I did send over uh, one little uh, demonologist just because I was trying to merge that up, <clears throat> but uh, I'm going to do this. Ooh, uh, do I want to do this? No, I'm going to save that level two because that level two will be solid for us in a little bit here. Um, I am going to keep on merging these guys though because uh, I might try and I'm going to merge these. I'm going to merge these just to, yes, that's what I wanted. See, it, so I knew that like the risk of merging that right there in order to get that um, group of engineers, 100% worth it. Um, that was what I needed to do. It helped me out significantly because uh, A, it gave us a level 3 engineer, which is solid this early on. And um, it just helped us out with... Uh, that I don't know what else, what else I was gonna say there. One, two, three, four, five, six. Okay, so I'll do this, get that going, um, and then obviously we're going up against Tribunal. So I need to save some of my um, I need to save my mana to be able to spam it. Uh, he's doing good. His Tribunal is gonna have way less health than mine. Mine will probably have what sixty thousand maybe, <clears throat> sixty three. Yep. So we'll still be able to take it out pretty easily. Obviously, I knew he was gonna do that. Um, and bum. So right there, I merged and sent a demon over to him, uh, just so that I could have an opportunity to to fill that area in. Uh, that was the only reason why we did that. Boom, boom, boom. Okay, good. Vampires are looking good, man. We're holding it down with them. Um, I'm gonna go ahead and do this because we don't need. Once you have a level three, you're good to go. The vampire will pretty much hold it down for you. Uh, I'll max this out. I'm kind of waiting. So right now, you can see the base ones are, are 3,000. So anything that I send will be 9. And then if I can get a level 2, I think that might be 18. I'm not sure. 18,000 health. Um, but watch this. So I'll send this over. And that one was 12. I guess they just changed. Yeah, so they just changed to 4 right there. This one's going to be 12. All right, so I'm actually going to try and create some pressure on him right now. Um, with all of this stuff going down. You can see all of my things in there. Uh, and now we can merge these and this and oh yo this is it this is it that's the move it's got 41,000 health over there i'm gonna keep on sending these oh yo he's about to be in so much trouble <laughs> look at all these that we're sending to him dude look at that i mean if his boreas's aren't proccing and his sharpshooters aren't hitting then like it's money dude it, that that that's gonna be game over for him i'm gonna keep this rolling here with all these you do have to pay attention to the clock because you don't want to send them if there's only like 15 seconds late because they won't make it and it'll be a waste but you can see right here we are starting to overrun him with them uh and yo i think that's it i think that's game for my man he was holding it down earlier but we came back put so much pressure on him with those demonologists or with those demons that's what i'm freaking talking about man that's what it's about you want to hold on to them 
uh, either until like the end of round two where bots are like 3,000 health maybe is what they are um, and then beginning around three especially if you can get things merging and you can have like level twos and level threes once you get those level threes in there they're like 42,000 53,000 things like that it really starts to overrun them especially if you're going up against a Boreas that has to uh, use his ability if you can get those down and its ability stops for seven seconds however long it is I'm not sure um, then uh, you're, you're gonna be able to overrun people super super easily so that's kind of where we're at with this I don't know that I've ever played this guy uh, he doesn't have anything that I need to worry about uh, really off the jump so we're not gonna merge these because they'll take them out instantly that would be a waste and we already have an engineer so I'm good to go there uh, I am gonna put one power up towards the vampire and then we'll see if we can get another vampire here we're going up against Gorgon which is actually gonna be sick if I can have enough damage down if I can have enough dam okay I'm, I might need to start uh, merge now nah, I should be fine if I can have enough damage down um, to defend then I can merge some of those and send them over to him while his things have rocks on them uh, that's kind of what you want to look at so I'm gonna get vampires up here one more time I might need to merge two of these just because I don't want us to get overrun we only have two engineers which would not be good against Gorgon obviously uh, yeah so I'm gonna merge a couple of these uh, I'm gonna, just gonna merge them all uh, merge that too and uh, obviously he's gonna kill it all but it did give us vampires and then uh, a level two engineer there which is which is good obviously I would have loved to have saved those but I don't want him to get so far down the line that my Gorgon is super healthy and I don't have enough DPS to take it out so that's the biggest thing there for sure um, I'm gonna keep on rolling with these and see if we can get some of ah, I really wanted to get those engineers connected nope that wasn't a good play right there there we go that's okay uh, okay sick now we got them connected which is what we want we can go ahead and level these up and we should be able to get this down at least to the corner so that our boss will only be like um, I don't know 62 health or something along those lines uh, we got 25 seconds to do so now I'm, I don't think this guy is a bot um, but he might be because he's using thunder and I'm not saying that in a mean way uh, I have just from my experience with the bots it seems like a lot of times they'll use that okay we're sitting solid man like this is money this is money now here's the only thing we don't have enough we don't have enough room to make moves with the demonologist so I need to get down to six engineers I don't want to have I don't want to have a whole bunch of engineers down uh, blocking me from being able to use uh, my thing that I really want to use so we'll max this out and I'll go ahead and go here I'll go ahead and go here and um, other than that nice so we have that so that the the two level two demonologists right there are gonna be good at the end right now you can see the bots are only what 2,000 so a level one would come out as um, 6,000 and I don't know what a level two will come out as uh, I kind of want to do it now just to see let's do it because we know we're at two came out as 16 um, and then he did a little bit of damage to it so it's double or it's times six I guess right um, yeah if they were at, were they at three or two I don't even remember somebody somebody in the comments do the math there it was I think they were at two two four six and then three times that six twelve eighteen I think is what it is could be completely wrong there um, just kind of oh dude I just messed up bro what are you doing dog what are you do okay we're sending all these in tribunals coming I'm not worried about it uh, go here and uh, here yeah I'm just I'm just gonna I'm just gonna beat him here look at this what's this one at 47 that or 46,000 y'all like making moves with this deck right now and people were sleeping on demonologists not me I've been trying to figure out how to win with it for a little bit trying to figure out my deck and this is it right here okay this is my deck this is the molt deck right here absolutely loving it again you can go with the priestess instead of the vampire if you want to um, and then also once I get once I get the shaman once I get the shaman I will probably replace um, maybe the summoner I'm not sure because summoners so I might I might replace the vampire honestly and just have no mana regen uh, and just troll the other person uh, and just hopefully be able to do enough damage I'm not sure we'll figure that out once we get there I'm sure that someone else who has the shaman will take this and kind of mess around with it um, 
but I'm excited, man. This deck is super fun. I hope that you guys enjoy. Make sure y'all check out Phone Cats' channel as well. If y'all are still here, I love you. I'll see you in the next one. Peace out.